Oh button. my god, I mean what? You have a serious problem. What is that task bar G? Well, what would you mean the tabs? The tabs. <laughs> nah 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 nah. I mean I mean bro, you need to seek help G. <laughs> what do you mean? Someone explain to me what the hell is wrong with Amin's uh fucking tabs. Why just so many? Bro, why? It, listen, listen, I think you have a phobia. Nah, geez, Talking about bro. phobias, I think you should go check out Tyler's video. It's down Jeez. below. Jeez, look up plug, yeah. Hey, you guys, welcome back to another video today. I'm here with Talax. Wagwan. Um, so we are back watching 10 Strangers Addictions. We did a reaction over at Talax's channel, which you can check out down below. Come on. Come we've, done, on. Uh, we've done 10 weirdest phobias, yeah. Mm. So that was there. So make sure to check that out, because I mean, it's yeah, a really interesting video. So hopefully, it's yeah. good. it was really good. I get, I get, I get really paranoid that I'm not recording, so I need to. Yeah, check trust me, trust me, trust me, bro. All right. Do you think? Do you think you have an addiction? Uh, except me, of course. <clears throat> not, come on, come on. I'm, how can I not be addicted to you? Look at you, guys. I don't think so. Uh, cod. I wouldn't say I'm addicted to it. Mm, but you are a banger. But I, but, I, but I only play 18 hours a day, so you know, it's only. doesn't mean I'm addicted. Doesn't mean I'm addicted, you know. It's only 18 hours. <laughs> Alright, let's find out the 10 strangest ones. Yeah, let's go, cuz. Casey became a widow back in 2011. <gasps> Bro? You know what? I actually remember seeing this actually on I think it was on Instagram or so. I remember seeing I don't know if it's the same woman though. She like I, I don't exactly know, but I think she like uh dips her finger in like the bag of ashes and just takes like a you know you know like when you like dip your finger in, like a pot of Nutella or something and you like lick your finger up. I think that's what she does. Why are you, why are you saying it like it's fucking normal? No nah, no nah, no, nah, you know, it's just you don't do it? <laughs> I think I like, think we should I think we should end the video right here. I think I'm done. Yeah, I think I uh, hope you guys enjoyed. Um, <laughs> <laughs> this is way beyond our league, G. <laughs> Casey was oh. not able to separate herself from the little black rectangular urn containing her husband's remains. She. I swear that's an Xbox. Man said he got the Xbox Series X early. What do you mean? Can I? Can I? Can <laughs> I put that in? Yes, that's an Xbox. <laughs> Man had to pause. I was like, "What's he gonna say now? Is that the new Xbox?" <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's that one terabyte storage. Jeez. <laughs> okay, let's start. This is not. This is not morally right, my bro. This is not morally right. But things took a dramatic turn for the worse when she started tasting the ashes in the box. Casey licked her finger and plunged it deep inside this the, is the urn one. and swallowed up ashes like it was powdered candy in a fun dip bag. In just two months, Casey <gasps> ate about one pound of ashes. I'm actually about to vomit, my bro. That is not right. One pound of ashes. That is not right. That is not right. He goes by his online alias, Dave Cat, is in love with fake women. <laughs> I'm not just talking about breast implants and hair extensions. I'm talking about life-size oh synthetic sex dolls. He saved for a year and a half to buy a $6,000 real doll, who he named Sidore Kuruneku. He says the... <laughs> what kind of tribal name is that, bruv? Sidore Kuruneku, bro. Kilo <laughs> Tabauni! <laughs> this guy gave her a genuine name. I just wonder how the conversations go. <laughs> so, how are you? Oh my god, same. <laughs> <laughs> I feel the same way. So, what do you like doing in your spare time? No oh way, god, same. Me too. <laughs> In 2012, he purchased another doll, Elena. According to Dave Cat, the girls are best of friends and they engage in bisexual activity when he goes to work. Man, man said, man, man said bisexual activity. They're dolls. They're dolls, G. He says that the arguments between him and Sidore are extremely few and far between. This 40 plus year old techno sexual yeah, and his synthetic soulmate wear matching yes. wedding bands, commemorating their love that started over 15 years ago. Man said 15 years, you know. A woman from. To be Matt's fair. More, Matt's more committed than any girls we know nowadays. Yeah, I, was, I was going to say, I was going to say, like, 
Like she might be fake, but but no, at least, no. At listen, least, listen, 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 listen. At least no I arguments. No, no, no arguments. Sex. A bisexual friend. What more could you ask for? You know what? When you put it that way, bruv, man's living the life. <laughs> sure, man's actually living the life. But we're going for this next one, though. Um, God, this is going to get weirder and weirder, isn't it? Bruv, I'm going to throw up after this. Run Queens, this New York, named Keisha, is a hoarder of soiled diapers. Not only does she sniff the diapers, but you won't believe that this woman chews and sucks on them as well. <coughs> hey! <coughs> That's not right, bro. That's not right. I think I was actually about to vomit there. I I have stepped away from my desktop. I mean, like there's there's one thing sniffing. Man said chews and sucks on it. It's not a. But you a little bit of vomit came up. <clears throat> I'm 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 not lying. Uh, might as well give it to her. She might fucking eat it up, bro. Oh, Weird woman, bro. Run the thing, run the thing. I want this. I want she this states, part of the video to end quickly. And I quote: "It has to have pee in it. It has to have pee in it." Okay, the ones okay. That have more pee smell better. She gets soiled diapers from friends and even strangers, and says that the taste is similar to sour candy. She hides the urine-soaked diapers in her purse and even in her car trunk to satisfy her cravings on the go. Yeah, what? She has a boyfriend. Okay, so wait, wait, wait. says so. Wait, I don't. I don't want to be. I don't want to be sad or depressed. Hey. But she has a boyfriend, and I couldn't even get a girl to look at me. How does that make sense, my bro? Let's go back to Detroit and meet Lisa. She's addicted to eating feline fur. That's right, this woman cannot go more than two hours without consuming her cat's hair. She claims that chewing the fur is relaxing, and that the hair has a very interesting texture. Bro, by the end of um, the year, her cat's gonna look like a chihuahua. <laughs> <laughs> Man said the chewing the cat's hair is satisfying. Have you tried extra gum, my bro? <laughs> you know that that, that shit is satisfying too. You know, that's a cat hair. How do you chew hair? D this video, this video is a prime example of why aliens don't visit us. They probably watch. <laughs> they probably watch this YouTube video. They probably watch this uh, in on their planet and be like, you know, what? there's some stupid fucks out there. Maybe maybe they're not ready. <laughs> these to guys, see us yet. these these guys are not advanced enough. We're not we're yeah. not messing with them. <laughs> They're not advanced enough. But don't worry, folks. She says she doesn't lick the cat's butts, though. Who? Oh, wow. Well, <laughs> thank, thank, thank you. Uh, wow. Wow. You love, you love, really love, changed my perspective of you. You're still a weird con. <laughs> <laughs> One hairy situation to the next, we come to okay, Evan. This off. young man is addicted to pulling hair out of shower drains. He does. Oh, uh, ah! uh, what the fuck, bro? I, I thought this would be like cocaine, heroin, you know, shit like that. Man said hair from shower drains. What is that blood? That looks like someone's weave, cuz. How did that get end up in someone's drain? That is tapped. Ham, Alabama. Okay. And she's addicted to bleach. Every day, she cleans her house from top to bottom with the stuff. The stove, the toilet, the refrigerator, and even the furniture oh, gets cleaning. a daily dose of bleach. No, Friends who come bleach. over say that they are slapped in the face by the smell. She goes through more than 3,000 gallons of bleach every year. But that's not the worst of it. Every morning, go, Gloria adds copious amounts of bleach to her bath water. She says that when her eyes get that glowing red burning sensation, it's time to get out of the tub. Just to be clear, on a leading bleach manufacturer's website, it states that bleach is not recommended for personal hygiene of any kind. You don't so fucking say it's acid. Oh my god. Like, okay, fine, cleaning your house every day, that's, it's, it's a bit tapped. But, you know, hygiene and all them things there, it's fine. Bleaching yourself, cuz. Man's already white. What are you trying to get rid of? This You have no melanin to get rid of. What are you doing? Let's oh, yeah. go over to Houston, Texas and meet Jay, a woman who is addicted. Oh, bro, what is this? Snowing baby powder. Just, I mean, it smells nice, but I wouldn't snort it, bruv. It ain't cocaine, G. I think this is her. Uh, this is her. Uh, so are, are you trying to say cocaine is more acceptable than baby powder? No, 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 what I'm trying to say is that yeah, she's, she's using this as a substitute instead of cocaine. Do you get me? Do you think so? How do you know? Huh? Don't worry about that, G. Don't ask me my questions. <laughs> <laughs> don't, don't ask me my questions, innit? Run the video, bro. Try <laughs> end it right now. If I leave right now. 
Christ. It's estimated that she's inhaled over 1,800 pounds of baby powder over I a 16 year my period. Screen, bruv. Get off my screen. Yeah, we're moving on from this. <laughs> oh, <laughs> my okay, no. oh my god. Oh my god. Nah, I mean, go back. I want to take my time with the baby powder. <laughs> oh, there's only a few seconds left. <laughs> and has no plans to stop. Oh, yeah. Vampires aren't just for your favorite premium shows on HBO. There's no. a strange woman out there right now that Man's sucks blood out you know. of necks, and her name is Julie. This Pennsylvania mother of three has been drinking blood for the last 30 plus years. Okay, all right. I think that's the last one. Julie. Yeah. All right, let's see. Yeah. Let's, uh, let's do this thing. What number blood. one is. Trina and Brian are a couple from St. Petersburg, Florida, who coffee are addicted enemas. to coffee enemas. Trina Whoa. is the worst of the two. Whoa, Every day, enemas. up to four times a day, she sticks a long rubber hose in her butthole and pumps warm coffee into her colon. Okay. And on that note, um, I don't, I don't know. I mean, do you want to carry on, or I'm, I'm confused because. Like, like with coffee, yeah, calm, you know, that one's there. Man pumps it into her blood. Is she a car getting unleaded petrol, G? What is this? No, no, he said the butthole. Yeah, they, that's what I'm saying. They pump it into their ass, into their, into their colon. Oh, God. Man All right. said... All right, it's the last, last video. Let's just, let's just get through it. Let's get through this. Brian says it. that you have to lube up the nozzle before inserting it into the rectum. Okay, uh, the I think, I think, uh... Come on, come on, we can, we can, we can, we can, it's literally a couple of, two, two minutes left, two minutes. Less than, less than a minute. ...the floor of her bathroom and reads a book or fills out a Sudoku puzzle while the magic elixir works wonders inside of her bowels. After 15 minutes of the caffeine calling... <laughs> this guy's descriptions are hilarious. Oh my god. <laughs> run it, run it, run it, run it. Blends, she rushes to the toilet and releases the murky mixture. Brian says you have to make a quick transition, otherwise little pieces of poo and coffee might hit the floor. Now that's what I call a crappuccino. Okay. <laughs> if it wasn't for this guy, I would have vomited by now, I'm not gonna lie to you. Bro, oh my god, this is so tight. Bro, this was... This video was made six years ago. I can't what believe this is real. I can't believe this is real. I vomited during, I nearly vomited during this video like three times, bro. Bro, I got off my seat because of this shit. What the hell? Thank you for watching, guys. If you have um, not enjoyed, I want you to like the video and um, tell me what you didn't enjoy about this video. Um, I wouldn't be surprised if you didn't enjoy any of it. Yeah, to be honest, yeah. yeah this this, this is tapped. But yeah. But I still want you to yeah. like it and let me know if you guys want us to, re to react to more things, uh, which we will do. If you guys have any ideas, you know, let, let them down in the comments below so we know what to react to next. Yeah, everything will be down below. Uh, my link, Talek's links, uh, his video as well. Please go check it out. Like, subscribe to me and him and his video. And I will all see you next time. Mm -hmm. Goodbye. Talex, Take care, lads. Do you want to, do you want to uh, give last words? I uh, love all of you and... Uh, um, end the video, bro. I can't... <laughs> what the hell? <laughs> Yeah, that one's there. Save. Save, guys. Save.